Morning Show, brought to you by Carnation Instant Breakfast Essentials. Complete nutrition from the start. <laughs> Bob Eubanks, and again, Juliet, back with you. Hey, did you know skipping breakfast could actually lower your IQ? Duh. Here to tell us just how essential breakfast really is, especially for your kitties, is the author of, you know her, it's Thea Factor Diet, the founder of SkinnyInTheCity.com, nutritionist Tanya Zuckerberg. Tanya, how's your husband, Glenn? He's great. Thanks. What was the most memorable place you made Whoopi? Mm, can't say, Mike. Let's talk breakfast. <laughs> the breakfast table. Is that true? There's a study out that says your children may have a lower IQ if you skip breakfast? Absolutely. A study that came out of Ohio State University showed mm. that kids who skip breakfast are more likely to have attention deficit disorder, behavioral problems, and lower IQs. And that's because breakfast is fuel for your body. You know, it's, it, you can't run a car without gas, and you can't think fast and get going without breakfast. Breakfast jumpstarts your metabolism for the day. And one more thing, studies show that breakfast eaters are more likely to maintain ideal body weight. Kids in this country are getting heavy, heavier than ever. We've got to start eating breakfast. This is the first time that she's ever gone one minute without saying the word fiber. Uh, well, <laughs> stay tuned. <laughs> we, we, we have to have fiber. Soon here. Fiber for breakfast, let me guess. Okay, well, there are three essential nutrients for kids. <laughs> first one, um, yes, perhaps it would be fiber. We have fiber, <laughs> calcium, and protein. Let's begin with the fiber. Now, why is fiber so important? Because it slows down digestion. If you send your kid off to school with Pop-Tarts or a sugary cereal, they might have instant energy, but 30 minutes later, their energy is in the tank, they're hungry, hard to focus. So, what you want to look for, whole grains. Swap out the white bagel for whole wheat bagels. Gotcha. Look for a cereal with at least 5 grams of fiber. Kids love cereal. They can't tell the difference between Cheerios and the fiber. No, and this right? one's no. even cuter. It has little hearts. This is a great cereal. And, of course, fruits. Fruits are a great source of fiber as well. Blueberries, toss them into the cereal or pack an apple in their kids' I mean, knapsack, send them off to school. People forget that fiber is in fruit. Yes, yeah. fruits okay. and whole grains. We also need calcium. Calcium. Okay. And calcium is essential for kids. While you're young, it's when you're able to store calcium in your bones. So you want to get around 1,200 milligrams, which is around four <laughs> servings of calcium. Skim milk, great option. Parents, you don't need to give your kids 2%. They are getting oh. enough fat in other foods. The protein is the same in skim and really? 2%. So go for skim. Of course, low-fat yogurt and cheese. Kids love cheese. String cheese. Low-fat low cheese? Of course, low-fat. Okay. And finally, protein. You want to combine the fiber and protein at every meal. That slows down digestion and keeps kids feeling full for a long period of time. But you want lean protein. So here we have eggs, peanut butter. Peanut butter is high in fat, but it's a monounsaturated mm -hmm. fat, which is heart so healthy. It's good, good for you. And it's surprising, you can give your kids bacon and eggs. I know what? bacon, whoa, isn't that high in fat? But this is turkey bacon. This is Canadian bacon, oh, both yeah. which are lean protein. Tanya, this is why we wanted to have you in, because we have this discussion all the time. I don't He's take time to eat all this stuff. I want to. Hey, look at you! I'm stupid. <laughs> uh, my IQ is dropping even as we speak. No, so I just want to suck it down with a juice. Well, is this a legitimate way to get all the fiber, it. calcium, and protein I need? Yep, yeah, this is a great <laughs> option, not just for kids, but for moms on the run as well. This is basically a meal in a glass. Why? Carnation Instant Breakfast actually combines fiber, calcium, and protein in one glass. This serving has double the amount of protein as an egg, and it has the equivalent of, as far as calcium goes, two servings of yogurt and four grams of fiber. So you're telling me, as a nutritionist, that you, this carnation and some breakfast, these quick breakfasts are good? Yes, of good course. For you. Okay. And the other ways that you can do it, you could either take it straight from the bottle, or you can even blend it up and make a smoothie. Oh, yeah. Or, of course, kids love to get involved. Give your kid the glasses of skin milk, the packet, they can mix it together and they can drink it. Definitely a better option than no breakfast at all. Thank, Thank you, you very much. Okay. And by the way, everybody in our audience here today, you're so lucky. You're going home with your own box of carnation and some breakfast essentials. And an egg. And for more information and some great recipes using carnation, log on to mnjshow.com. Don't go away. I'm coming right back. Thank you, Tony.